Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Anna and this is my channel. Um, today's video is just going to be a makeup, eyeshadow look, um, little good, um, contour. I've already done my foundation and my eyebrows um, just kind of to speed through it. And yeah, oh, and it's also going to be, um, I think this month. It's Speedbox because I didn't show you last month and yeah so um get you a snack get you a drink it's not gonna be that long I'm gonna try and make it short and sweet for you guys and let's get to it so let's just go ahead and get the It's Be Box out of the way and then we'll go ahead and finish today's look um so yeah this is this month's It's Be Box it always looks like this I think yeah so this is the paper. It's um, it says bear yourself, and it's a little different than normal. It's like up like this now. So it's cute. Um, let's just get to it. I got some more of these brushes. These are the Farah brushes. Um, these are be yourself, be beautiful, and these look like these are um the last brushes I got were the Farah ones, and they were the eyeshadow brushes. These are the Farah Show Me Magic eye brush set. So another eye brush set. Okay. I thought it was something different, but I guess one of my friends or my mom will be getting an eye brush set. Uh maybe not this set because these are kind of cool looking. So that's what the handles of them look like. Oh my gosh, I think these are like so it has the name on it and then it also says um this is a mini a mini smudging or <laughs> it's a mini mini shading this is um a concealer could have used that one today but i didn't um and this is a mini taper the brushes are really soft so they're real nice i think they're just like my, this set um, but this is the largest. I guess these are the minis. So that's the difference. I don't know. Tell me if there really is a difference. Um, this is an angle brow, which I don't really use brows. I usually just use this, um, elf one for like, get from Walmart for like $3 or something. And, and then I just use that. I don't really, I mean, when I get the e.l.f. Pompeii, I use a brush, so that would be nice, but I will mainly probably use this brush for eyeliner whenever I do eyeliner. Um, I get mad and angry, so I don't do it often. And then this is a pencil brush, so um, I guess you could probably use this for, hmm, don't know, probably like little... Um, details with eyeshadow or just like any kind of little detail you want to use it for I'm pretty sure but yeah um, these are the fairer be beautiful be you brushes they are valued at $50 just like the other fairer brushes were um, I don't think I'm gonna keep the silver ones just because I like these and I don't know we'll see we'll see I know I'm gonna keep one because I don't need I mean, I guess you can never have too many brushes, but can't be selfish like that. You have to share. The next thing is this Tarte Big Dream Amazonian Clay Palette. It is um, the big eyeshadow, uh, the Dream Big Eyeshadow Palette. It is valued at $30. Um, I don't normally buy Tarte or anything like that. I did buy them. Um, I have some things from Tarte and... Um, they're okay, but, um, yeah. so let me open it. It shows you the colors on the packaging. The ca packaging is really pretty. Um, the metallic -y gold packaging or whatever. It, it looks just like the actual packaging. It's like a little mirror. Alrighty, so we're going to open this bad boy up and it's nice. I like the little clear things. I normally keep the clear things with all the packaging if I can. Um, I don't know. It's just 
I don't know if everyone does that or if it's just me. Um, so I'm going to hide the mirror from you guys, but here are the colors. Really nice and rose goldy and all like that. I like when there's names on the colors. <sighs> I don't know why I can't explain it to you, but I just do. It's just another like little pro for me. Um, I'll do some swatches for you. Who am I? I like the little, I like the silver one, like the glitter ones. I don't know. I love glitter. I'm um, especially in eyeshadows. So, okay, so this is, I'm going to do four, four swatches for you. And I'm, I'm noticing I'm gonna have to, I like have to go in twice to get a good swatch. Um, I did Risk Taker, Happening, I'm gonna do Hustle. Hustle felt different. Um, Hustle felt a little more rugged than the others. I like that. Hmm. Nice texture. Um, the glitter is definitely popping out in all of these. Um, and then I'm gonna do This Is It. So, okay. This is it didn't take much for me to get, I guess, because that was my little air freshener. Sorry, guys. Okay, so those are the swatches for all of them. Um, they're picking up really nice on camera. I don't think the, the like, showing how shimmery it is is picking up nice on camera, but normally I will uh, put the product on the brush and then spray my brush with some like makeup mist like this this makeup mist that obviously I'm running out of but that's okay because I have it everywhere already so yeah um, and then normally I'll put it on there and the shimmer really shows up better if you guys didn't know it there you go there's a little makeup hack but I'm pretty sure everybody knows that Suva Beauty Liquid Chrome Illuminating Drops um, I think that's just a fancy way of saying highlighter. Um, in this bottle, and that's the pro like the the boxes. I'm really bad at not showing you guys the boxes. I'm sorry. I don't know if you guys like that or not, but um, it is the liquid chrome and lubining drops in Trust Fund, and the value is twenty six dollars. This is the color. I love it. I love this. That it's like a dropper, like an actual dropper. I don't know why, but it's just so nice. Nice. Was that weird or was that satisfying? I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. All right, so now let's do a. But there's a whole bunch of product. Like you don't even need to drop it. Just put that bad boy right there, and you're good to go. So we'll put a little like that, and just. So that's the, that picks up nice, that looks real nice. Is this Havana, Havana, probably not how you say it, hydration cream mask. Um, I like the color, this blue tealish color. It is valued at $33. Um, I haven't even opened it, even to smell it, if it has a smell. I hope it don't have a smell because I don't like when things smell because then I don't I'm, I don't want my face to smell like that. So okay, I can't open it that way. Okay, so it doesn't have a smell, and it's like white like a little mask. We'll just put a little right there on our hand. That it has a little fragrance, but but it might just be like the stuff they use in it. It's soft. So, we'll try that. And then, the other thing I have is not up here because it's a nail polish and like, as soon as I start using the nail polish, it's on my table wherever I'm at. But it is the Smith & Colt Nail um, Polish and Pillow Pie. And it's valued at $8. And it's cute. I'll have to... Um, I don't know how to insert a picture. 
So I'll just leave it in the description box below and you guys can go click on it and see what it looks like. But anyways, like the, the lid of it, when I took it off the first time, it wasn't attached to the actual like thing, like the, the brush. And I thought that was normal, but then like when I did it again, it was attached to it. So I was like, oh, I guess it, it's supposed to be attached to it, but whatever. Um, so yeah, that was the Itsby box. Um, that lasted longer than I thought it was going to, so we're just gonna um, hop right into today's look. So I'm going to use this Huda Beauty 3D highlighter palette that I received from either last month's Itsby box, not last month's, I don't think I showed you last month's, but or the month before. Um, I really enjoy using this palette. I don't use it as much. I normally just use um, my e.l.f. contour palette just because I'm that person. But um, so what we're going to do is first we're going to go in with this color down here. And it tells you up here what to use each other one for, which is really cool. Um, it says to apply it under the cheekbones to add dimension and shape. I'm going to go in with my Sigma Large Angle Contour Brush F40 that I also received from either an It's Be Plus or just a regular It's Be bag. Are oh, these little baby hairs going crazy? So, um, when this video goes up, it's going to be like... I'm hoping soon, like I'm hoping either, if not tonight, tomorrow, um, but when it goes up, I was planning on already posting, um, like, a little short chit chat sit down video, like, about what's going to be happening with my life in a couple of months, um, not even three months, it's going to be happening. And I thought about posting that, but and I recorded it and everything, and I went to go edit it, but I just didn't like it. So I obviously haven't posted it because you guys haven't seen it. So I'm going to um, re-record that and then hopefully post it sometime this week as well, if not next week. I'm not for sure. Um, but yeah. That's what's going down right now. I figured you guys would like a more like detailed video about like what's going on. Oh, what I'm using right now is the Capri as a base to smooth skin and to amplify the light reflecting pearls right here. I guess I should have used this. Um, I guess I should have used this before I put the other one on but I didn't pay attention so that's okay we're just gonna go along like I did pay attention so anyways like I was saying I think you guys um, deserve that and I think I'm, it'll be a good video I don't know how long it will be just depends on how long I feel like I can talk for um, and like, yeah, another reason why I didn't like the other one I rec recorded was because I felt like I was just jumbled up in it. And I wasn't, um, I was just going back and forth, back and forth. And I didn't like that. So I wanted to more be more organized with this one. And hopefully it'll turn out better. So now I'm just using, obviously, um, the highlighter, um, from the cheek to temple, whatever, I just apply the highlighter however the heck. I like to apply the highlighter because in my eyes, I can never have too much. That's that. Um, I never use blush nowadays, but I'm going to use this Ibiza blush. Why not? It's a healthy glow. Reason why I don't use blush is because like I have a lot of, I have like textured skin and I just feel like it brings, it brings... Um, tension there. Now, I don't want no one looking there because nobody wants no one looking there. But, it's not bad. Um, so moving on, I don't have time to do that. So moving on to my eyes, I guess we'll go ahead and use 
between these and my other ones. Um, I'm going to use, I never do my eyes no more, but that's okay. I'm going to use this. I'm going to be using the Big Dream Tarte palette that we got today. Not today, we got this month because, just because we're going to use it. Um, I'm going to, I don't have like a eyeshadow primer. I use concealer. Um, so what we're going to use is the 16 hour concealer that I received from an influencer box. Um, which, if you guys don't know what influences, influencer is, you need to. Influencer, um, basically you review products that you use every day or whatever and you rack up points and stuff like that and then that you take quizzes and they send you boxes and you get free full-size products I got both of these colors I got light sand and light peach um, and I've using the light peach I used it under my eyes um, to brighten it you know I don't think it looks bad at all so I'm gonna just go ahead and use it to in like the pro the you get so much product so like I don't need all that because my eyeballs are small so we're just gonna wipe a little bit off and then do that so that's me too right now then take my finger and go like this alrighty so now we are ready to do the eyes I'm gonna go in with the large shading brush my large fair shading brush number 65e um received from an influencer box no i lied received from my it's plus box we're gonna go in with just like um a base color so we're gonna go in with ambitious this color down here and just swirl your brush in there you don't have to dab it you know a lot and then tap off the excess And I don't think I'm nowhere near as good as some people who post videos on YouTube or anything like that. I just, I just do me and, oh well, to another brush. I'm gonna need, I need something for like my crease. I have makeup brushes in the set my husband got for me for Christmas two years ago. But I guess I need to try other brushes because I guess I do. Um, so we're going to try the our, one of my new mini shading brushes. It's also a Farrah. Um, go into my crease with one of these. Okay. Um, we'll go in with this Go For It color, the brown. Just slightly dab it in there because I don't need, I don't want a lot. I don't want a lot of brown right there. This is the look we got going on right now. It doesn't look the best, but you just go with the flow. You know, you can't always, you just don't know until it's done. Alright, so I feel like I can't use, I need more colors. Like, I need a solid color. So, I'm going to go in with my Hold of Beauty um, Smoky Obsession that I've also received from an It's Be Plus bag. If you guys don't know, I don't buy makeup. I just... I guess I do buy makeup. I just spend $25 a month and I get all these products and I'm a happy camper. And thank God for online shopping. So, yeah. Anyways, we're going to go in with this um, pumpkin color, burnt orange. We're just, we're just, we're just doing a fall look today. And I'm just going to go like all over the lid and then not really in the crease but down you know what i mean probably not but that's okay i don't even know if this is gonna look good
Okay, okay. So who is ready for fall? Because let me tell you, I am. I have already got a pumpkin on my porch, which if you don't follow my, or if you don't, if you're not on my Facebook page, um, don't know why not, but I'll link that down in the description box as well. And you'll see, I already have a pumpkin on my porch because my friend gave it to me. I already have a pumpkin mug from TJ Maxx because who doesn't? I have pumpkin socks. I have this pumpkin sitting on my desk that says Hocus Pocus. Like, hello, who? Dollar store, baby. Like, that's. You can't beat it. I'm so ready for fall. And all these people out here that are dissing pumpkin spice and dissing fall. Bye. I don't need that negativity in my life. I need leaves on the ground. I need fall. I need scary movies. And shh, that's all. Why, you may ask, because I don't, that's my favorite. And I just want to experience it before I leave. But anyways, so we're going to go back to this one and we're going to put this. Um, I think we're going to use, yeah, we're going to use this is it because I like the pigmentation on it. And we're just going to go in with the mini shading brush I guess we're just gonna wipe off well what's this one okay you know what let's use this Luxie precise blending brush I think I got this from an itsby bag not for sure but that's okay um and we're just gonna swirl our brush in there a little bit and then dab off the excess or excess or however you say it this eye looks darker than that eye so I'm probably gonna have to fix it so let's fix that before I even get started. I guess I should just put music on and not let the freaking murder show going on downstairs. But. Sorry guys. Just gonna blend it. You know, lighten it up a little bit. We'll blend this one. And so, okay. So now we'll go in with this. Um, is it still wet? No, it's not. So we'll go back in with this is it. And we'll respray it. So, got a little shimmer going on there, um, but it's not enough shimmer for me. <laughs> so, we're going to go back with this Huda Beauty, and we're going to go with this gold color, gold color shimmer. I like it. I like it so much. And the same process. 
But we're gonna put this a little on the end. Okay, so now we're going to go back in with that concealer and just kind of like clean the look up a little bit. Alright, so I guess this look needs a little liner because it just looks cool. It looks good. So, let's look for an eyeliner. There doesn't look the best because I can never get them to look the same. So moving on from eyeliner, we're going to put the eyes up for a minute. Um, I hope it's looking decent so far. So we're almost done. I'm gonna go in with my eye mascara now. This is the Thrive Thrive Liquid Lash Extension I don't think it makes me look like I have lash extensions but it Oh, we don't got no lips on. How are we going to go anywhere without no damn lips, Anna? Um, let's do... My lip. Guys, this is what I don't want. Wear eyeliner. Because I'm missing. Oh. Alright. See, this one looks alright. This one, she got mine of her own. She look like someone her mama don't want her looking like. Anyways, oh well, you know. I love this color. Um, I wish I knew what the freaking name of it was so I could order it offline, but it's an Ofra. And it says It's Beyond Zip, but I don't think that's the name. Um, but I wish I could find it. But we're going to wear it. For someone with some seriously small lips, it takes me seriously forever to put some lipstick on. This is an issue with a lot of things I get from Itsby. I don't know why.
was good timing. All right. Okay, so I think we can spray now. I got a haircut. Anyways, so this is the look. Remember, we're gonna not mind the eyeliner because why not? But the highlight is good. So, thank you so much for watching the whole video. For those of you who do or who did um don't forget to like comment subscribe please um tell me what you like tell me what you dislike please just give me some feedback i greatly appreciate it like i said i'm gonna link everything i can in the in the description box below and um remember to love your neighbor and just be thankful for your loved ones and be kind to one another until next time remember my name is anna and i love each and every one of you bye